I didn't have to break stride or anything. I just hit the thing clean as a whistle, first time. And you can't feel the ball hit your foot. It was such a clean, strikeable ball. I remember it like it was yesterday. And uh, I, I, can, I can smell the arena. You know, you can, it was an evening kickoff. The grass was so glistening with dew. There's a lot I do remember about it uh, and, and a lot still stuck in my mind. And it was one of the greatest moments in my sporting career. So it's in there forever. For a Norwich City fan, there is no greater treasure trove than Jeremy Goss's attic. Framed football shirts and pictures that capture the Canaries legend's fondest memories. I love this one. This is a, this really is, I think, it's the facial expressions that captures it all for me. This weekend, it will be 20 years since Jeremy scored that goal. His volleyed winner at Bayern Munich was the champagne moment of Norwich's historic European adventure and the champagne moment of the midfielder's career. This was so, so special because it was with the club that I love, still love dearly. It was something that I worked very, very hard for over many, many years at Norwich City Football Club. It was like a reward for me for trying so hard. You know, I showed a lot of resilience because of the rejection that I had over the years of being, I played over 500 reserve team games for Norwich City. And there were many times I fell out of love with the game and I fell out of love with the club and wanted to move. And that's how bad it got. And I, but I kept, I kept my head on my shoulders. I got my, you know, I got myself working harder. I became more resilient and more determined to prove to the fans that I could play. The memorabilia tells the story the boots that thumped home the volley, and the shirt swapped with the former German captain. But after two decades, Jeremy is willing to pass on these pieces of city history. I've had all this stuff in my loft for over 20 years. It's just gathering dust. Um, I've got Lothar Mateus' shirt. I've got Dennis Bergkamp's shirt. I've got three shirts from Vitesse Arnhem, Bayern Munich, Inter Milan, all signed by the players. I've got my boots that I wore through the, through the two-season campaign that I had a really good two or three seasons with Norwich there. It's pointless them gathering dust and I feel the time's right now. If somebody does offer me the right money and it is the right individual, uh, then, I'll, then I'll be keen to pass it on, yeah. Jeremy has been asked about that one goal more than any other achievement in his career. But he doesn't mind. How lucky am I to be remembered by something I've done well rather than something I've done bad? You know, we can name one or two England World Cup players who have missed penalties in crucial games and they get remembered for crucial misses. How lucky am I that I get remembered for something like this? It's, it's a wonderful thing. It's a wonderful thing that will be celebrated once again at the weekend. And even after 20 years, one suspects that won't be the last time. Rob Setchell, Mustard TV, Norwich.